You guys here for the cat club? Who's this nerd? Chad, don't be such a Richard. Hey, arts program. Useful to society again? No? Okay, why don't you shut your latte hipster drinking mouth and why don't you stop being a man child? Why don't we all just focus on why we were all just unconscious like a minute ago? I don't know what that means. That's because you're not cultured. Oh, I'm not cultured. No. I'm not cultured. No. Okay. Have you seen Wall Street? Michael Douglas? Charlie Sheen? I haven't, but I assume it was good. Yeah, how's the Wall Street thing going? How's your stock market? What is it? What are you talking about? You're so dumb. Like, seriously. All right, um, I'm gonna get out of here. Has anybody tried the door? It's locked. Let a bro try it. It's like something out of Saw. Oh my god, we get it. You watch films. Oh, be quiet. Just write that in your academic journal. No computers. I'm writing in your academic journal. We're in an academic environment. Of course, I'm going to have an academic journal. And she does yoga too. So, uh, yeah, we're kind of locked in. What do you guys want to talk about? Oh, I gotta go lifeguarding soon. Stare at some lady swimsuit butts. Oh my god, Chad. You're Shut up. Just stop. Stop. But they're nice. Just stop. Just, we, we, don't, we don't need to hear about this. I feel like I should really express myself and I just want to express the importance of climate change. Let's talk about climate change. Mistake. You're an environmentalist now? That's not even part of the arts program. That's... Let me break something down for you, lady. All right? Climate change, right? Climate change is a left-wing Zionist conspiracy set out to put my hard-earned tax dollars into Flippin' polar bears! Stop nodding and agreeing. You have no idea what he's talking about. Let me tell you... What time is it? Like 9 a.m.? Who the hell is playing polka music at 9 in the morning? Like you guys need that money? Yeah. You want 
You want to talk about the, the turf field there, buddy? That was a good idea. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, yeah man. How many people are using it again? I do it every day with my bros. Uh, yeah? 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 yeah. Do, a little, uh, do a little workout on some, like, golf grass? Mm -hmm. Yeah, whatever. Guys, okay. I know golf grass is important and business is important, but there's a dead body in the closet. Yeah, I guess we can acknowledge that. Okay. It's uh, two locked doors and a uh, closet. <laughs> Means that somebody in this room is the murderer. We can rule out Hermione over here because she's dead. Sky. Yeah. And I know it wasn't me because I'm just here for this. And I don't know. I, I'm not in much competition with the arts program. Let's be real here. So let's see. Let's see what we got here. We got the nobody with no name. I have a name. The nobody with no name. And then we got Ben Chef over here pretending like he's hot stuff. <laughs> I don't need to pretend, buddy. Well, guess what, guys? What? There's a murder, and the arts program has been cut. <laughs> That's good. Whoa, that reggae music's on again. It's polka. Probably going to die. Who did it? Are you seriously gonna play that with me? Yeah. Yeah. Well, let's play a little process of elimination, shall we? It's just you and me left in the room, and the other two are dead in the closet. Who do you think it was? It's a good question. At least Chad's got them. Yeah, right. Yeah, okay. Anyways, I think it was you. Don't play coy with me. I am not a fish, nor am I playing. I know you did it. I know you stabbed those people and chopped them up and threw them in that closet, and I want to know why. You can't accuse me of something like that. You don't even know my name. You... I want to say Terrence. What is your end game? What is your end game? You trying to play me? You filthy Frankfurt School alumni. I'm just trying to get my money and get out of here. But no, you want to play your polka band, don't you? That's all you business people ever want is your money. You want to be one of the, the, the top 1%, huh? You want to take everybody down here, middle class, lower class, and just get rid of them all and take your stupid little green back? Well, it's better than being the 99! Have you ever caught a fish with your bare hands, sir? Not one for sleeping. You didn't have to eat it, right? You understand the patterns mm -hmm. of fish swimming. And you're a human, so you grabbed it up. You oh, fuck. Oh, you, oh, 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 oh. you can rip it apart. You can put it back. Um. Fung didn't rip me apart. 
Do you ever pick up a fish and try teaching it something? Have you ever fucking picked up a fish with your bare hands and tried teaching it something? Can you imagine you taught it something? set myself up. Uh, that's, that's okay. We can do that, right, Hank? Yeah. Okay. okay. Alright. Uh, thank you. Ask me again! I will. Do Ask you, me again! Do you blame him for anything? I don't blame Punk for nothing. I don't blame Punk. I'm thankful. I am so fucking thankful. And you know what? I fucking really hope that you'll be able to understand when we go see him. I really hope we will. And I don't mean that as a threat. People think I'm threatening when I say that. Like it's some bad thing. Like it's some scary thing. Like it's some Marilyn fucking Manson thing. Charles Manson. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> So, well, I believe Funk is a nice guy, so it's just really hard to get to know him. So, well, I believe he has his, he has his moments, so, like, just like everybody, so, all you just have to do is get to know him, so, that's all I can say. Um, I guess what I mean is, what brought you to this institution, to this building? How fast? Whoever picked me up. I know what you're really trying to ask me is, did I? What did I do to him? I didn't really do what they are saying I did. I was just, you know, I'm. I like people. I like people. I really do. And I. There are certain things people do that I fucking don't understand. That just makes me more interested, and I can't figure it out. I've been here. Why is there, why is there all this stuff, like, what? What's it all I mean? I really miss it here. I don't like what, what it should be done in this place. So, this is where he held you for three years? Yeah. And you, uh, and you've just forgiven him for it. It felt like so much longer. He brought me here, it's where he kept me. Not where I was, though. Yeah. So is this MLS? Come on, yeah. Twenty more minutes. We got here a little early, but we'll be there soon. Sandwiches? I 
guess what I'm trying to get at is, do you hold no contempt against Fung for what he did to you? Why haven't you pursued any, you know, legal ramifications against him? Don't, don't you care? Legal ramifications against him? I've been vouching for his innocence and what does contempt mean? You don't harbor any bad feelings towards him for bad anything feelings? Did? Bad feelings. To put it simply. Emotionally? Emotionally? Physically? I mean... I feel fine. I feel fine. Physically, my wounds have healed. And do I feel mentally fine? Mentally? Obviously. <laughs> um, do you... Do you, do you, do you, um, do you har harbor, uh, like, uh, negative feelings toward a, a, a little girl for eating a ham sandwich? 1614, I saw first, first shipment of cured tobacco from Virginia. I was on that ship. Sorry.